This hey next test guys, emancipation grills. I'm LB. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Yes, Gladys, I do remember. Uh, hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Revisionized by Nintendo Irk. Actually, an old Puzzle Maker puzzle of mine, tweaked and of course fully hammered. I had a hard time publishing this, finding issues in previous versions and being unable to update. I had to republish completely. Why does Valve hate us Portal fans? Creation time, about 10 hours. Hashtag full hammer, hashtag lasers, hashtag fizzlers, hashtag reddit, hashtag open door policy. Okay, I found I can update after Steam has restarted. Weird. Alright, well, let's get started, shall we? Hammer indeed. Oh, look at this! I like this. This is neat. <laughs> you don't see this very often. I like- I like this glass inset lighting design. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Interesting. So this goes... Ha! <laughs> ha! I like the way this is done, that's kinda strange. Isn't there, like... I know co-op has, like, half and half signage, or something, but, yeah. And if we fall off here, there's no going back. But, that's fine, because this... There's nothing we can do in here to turn off this fizzler anyway. Man, those shadows look strange. <laughs> oh my. So that turns off the fizzler. I'm assuming this is... Stairs? Has to be, right? Okay, so that receiver will turn off this fizzler and it will activate the stairs. Gotcha. Got some nice little debris in the corner. Seems to be the debris from that, in fact. That's always nice, when you see debris, you should also be able to see where the debris came from, and in fact you can see it right here. Very nice map design. Look at this. You can see through it. That's nice. Ha! <laughs> I like that. Aha. Uh -huh. Interesting. Does that did I even hit the right thing? I don't know. I mean, there's- there's a few ways to find out, of course. Let's, uh, let's just do this, for now. And that. Well, that does work, okay. Oh. <laughs> hmm... Maybe I should've had the cube pointing at that, shouldn't I? That's okay, I need to get up there in the first place anyway. How can I do that? Perhaps I just need the cube in here. Perhaps we need to go back in order to go forward. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, come on. There we go. Right, so... What happens if we take this into here? Not much, actually. Not very different. Oh, but, you know what is different? Is that now I can do this. Yeah, there we go. Now I can have the stairs, and I can get up there. Let's go ahead and save at this point. And then there's this little lip for me to stand on, which is nice. So then I can just do that. Uh-huh. Oh. But the cube does not auto-respawn. That's fine, we can just grab it. I mean, the cube does not have a manual respawn, is what I'm trying to say. But as I just said, we can grab it. So let's see, this lines up right there. Yep, that'll work. Now we just grab the cube. Yeah, 
place that here first. Well done. There we go. You know, when I woke up and saw the state of the labs, I started to wonder if there was any point to going on. I came that close to just giving up and letting you go. But now, what? looking around, seeing Aperture restored to its former glory, you don't have to worry about leaving ever again. I mean that. <laughs> GLaDOS's voice sounds more echoey there, but anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!